In this short tutorial, we'll learn how to change the background color by using the C Sharp programming language. When you print anything on the console window using C Sharp, you notice that the background color of the console window is black, whereas the default font color is white. So in this tutorial, we'll learn how to change the black background color by writing C Sharp code. So let's print a simple string on the screen by using the by using the right line function in the console class. So if I run this program, you will notice that the default color of the console window, the default background color of the console window is black, whereas the default font color is white. Now we want to change the background color uh, when we print any string on the screen. So we are not we are not trying to change the background color of this whole window, but we are just trying to change the background color behind this string which gets printed. So how can we do that? The console class has a property by the name background color. So this background color property is of the type enum and that enum is console color. Enums actually give you a list of options to choose from. So the console color enum gives us a list of colors to choose from. So when we use the dot operator with the console color enum, we see a list of uh, colors from which we can choose. So let's say we choose the color blue. So now with this line of code, we are setting the background color of the console window uh, to blue. So when this string will be printed, the background color behind this string will be blue. So let's see the output. So here you notice that the background color of the string has now changed to blue from black. So if let's say I copy these lines and I paste them here, and I change the background color to red and I print another string. So this string will get printed with its background color blue, whereas this string will get printed with its background color red. So let's run this program and see the output. So here you can notice that the first string has its background color set to blue, whereas the second string has its background color set to red because we have changed the property uh, of the background color to red in this line. So with this, We'll end this short tutorial here. For more free C Sharp programming learning content, visit openeschool.com slash learn C Sharp.